Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Andrea Silvestro and welcome back to another Dimash reaction. Here we are to react to Dimash singing Stranger at the Shine Super Brothers season two Yoku Shu show. So we will get on with that right now. I'm excited to see because I know you guys requested different versions of Stranger a lot. So we will get on with that right now. This is such an intense song. I remember reacting it to it one time. I don't remember what it sounds like, but like I just remember it was a journey and I'm ready to be put on that journey. It is so um entrancing with these people who are just like walking behind and then leading up to the stage and he looks like he's like kind of giving me vampire vibes. I will not lie to you. Oh my gosh how did he even sing like that it didn't even sound like dimash am i like crazy the vocal fry and everything right there and it's like so it's so clear Jeez, that was like chilling how we can go from one to the other so fast Lives and lost that flaws feel the mysteries. New ground, far as I can see. New ground underneath my feet. Stranger in a stranger's land. New chance to know who I am if I had the strength. To begin again. It's so intense. It literally feels like the movie of like, it, so it sounds like a movie soundtrack. I think I mentioned this before, but like, it sounds like the like hero slash villains, like main song, like getting his strength and just like moving forward. I love it. Begin again. interesting how he did that with his voice i don't know how he did that but i am very here for it that was really interesting how he did that with his voice that was something that i've not seen from him before run was a journey that run was such a journey like i don't even know where that was crazy the way he like 
changed it up mid run and then he like i don't know he like changed his inflection mid mid run he dragged out like the ends of his notes and like made them all connect and everything and then he made it like he brought it down with that nice little "Ah," or whatever he just did crazy that was like because i didn't know where it was gonna go but then he like brought it back down and like ran back down with it that made no sense i'm so sorry you guys my brain is shot but that was just a very interesting run and i appreciated the intricacies that he included in it excuse me was so much okay i feel like i need to go back because there were so many things that i like was shook by but i didn't have the time to like fully dive into first off how does he hold that note for so long and it's like it didn't even wane at all it didn't even like well i don't really expect his notes to ever be like weak at all but it literally just the pitch was perfect it was just perfectly on pitch like i guess people at home try to like sing any note that's even in your range for like 20 seconds and not have it change at all like it's kind of hard for even me if i sing like a note it like changes a little bit sometimes it'll it'll, the pitch will change like a little and i have to like adjust it a little bit and go up or go down you know like that's just natural after you've held a note for that long but of course dimash it's like literally just like a piano you might as well just like it's right on i understand but um yeah he has amazing pitch also where was it this part where he was like, I'm going to assume, I don't know if this was true or not, but was this just like a, something that was dubbed over it or did he actually say that? I don't know, but that was really intense. There was like the monster voice. I was like, oh, oh my gosh. I don't really put it past him to be able to sing like that or like speak like that, but I just didn't know. It's so intense. And then into angel voice, like I cannot. That part was chilling for real, like, like the. Like the, like the slide up to the whistle was just so like satisfying. Like I really loved it. And like, you can even see with his movements, it's like kind of mirroring what he's doing. It's like, like going, going up to that whistle note, you know, it's kind of interesting when people sing and how like their body language is actually kind of like predicting where they're going to go or what they're going to do with their voice. It's crazy how like the two can be connected. You And even like this whole setup, also he's insane, I can't believe it. But even when it like, it cut to just him on the stage and it like had the lights and it's all, like all the attention and like the the eyes go just to him because of the stage setup and how it's lit up. And then you don't really notice like everything else going around. But I think also the singers in the back are, they're kind of acting as the choir are making it sound a lot more haunting than it would have if it was just him up there. And I think the fact that they were also live instead of just like a track really added to just like the chilling atmosphere. Just like this song just feels like it should be in a movie. It has such like a heroic and powerful element to it that I really think that it could be used as movie music. Like there's just so much intensity and it's like, it's like high, high energy. 
you know what I mean? Like, he's main character. Like, that's what I'm getting from this. But we will continue on. But, like, that's just kind of something I noticed, like, visually as well that helps with putting all the attention towards Dimash. You insane even the end with like the chorus chorus is going oh 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 that leads to the end crazy dimash is so insanely talented i feel like we realize that more and more every time i see him i just can't believe that this man is real um i really liked the i think the new version of stranger i preferred but this one's still like great but the new version of stranger i don't know what it was when i watched it i was so shook i don't really remember maybe i should go back and rewatch it but that was like insane the the one version of stranger because it had the huge stage i believe it was crazy but stranger is just like a very high intensity song i definitely get how it could get you like completely hyped for whatever you're about to do with your life but feel free to let me know if you guys want any more dimash reactions or any other songs that i should react to because i'm starting to like not know exactly what to react to because i feel like i've reacted to a lot of the main stuff so if you guys have any other ones or if dimash would release a new song then i could totally react to that but let me know what you think feel free to subscribe and ring the bell comment your thoughts let me know what you think and i will see you guys in the next video Goodbye.